hello guys welcome to my channel today in this video i'm going to show you how to fix when you are unable to install this update that is kb5015807 so if you are unable to install this update on your windows 10 computer then please follow the steps shown in this video now the first step is to run update troubleshooter for this go to the start menu then click on settings now click on update and security and then click on troubleshoot now click on additional troubleshooters Click on Windows Update and then click on Run the Troubleshooter. Once the troubleshoot is complete, restart your computer and then update your Windows 10 once again. So make sure that you re restart your computer after the troubleshoot is complete and then try to install the update. Now still you are unable to install this update then use Windows 10 Update Assistant to install it. So copy this link. The link is provided in the video description. Open this link in a browser. It will take you to Microsoft website. Here you can see update assistant. Click on update now and then run this exe file. Click on run and then click on yes to allow. Now this will load Windows 10 update assistant. If there is any pending update over here, it will give you an option to install or update. So this may take a couple of seconds and if you see the install or update option, update your Windows 10. Still you are unable to install in that case, reset Windows update components. For this, copy all these commands. These commands are provided in the video description. So copy the command till here. Now open notepad on your computer. Paste all the command in notepad. Go to file, then click on save as, and then you can save it to desktop. And then name this file as wufix.bat and then for save as type select all files and then click on save. Now go to desktop make a right click on wufix.bat file then click on run as administrator. Make sure that you are opening this file as an administrator. Click on yes to allow. Now this will open command prompt. And first of all, it will stop all the Windows update services and then it will run some scans. Now there are a couple of scans. So the scan will take some time. Once all the scan is complete, it will restart all the Windows update services. And then once done, restart your computer. Make sure that you restart your computer once the process is complete and then try to update your Windows 10 once again. Now the next step is to use media creation tool. So if nothing works, you can copy this link. The link is provided in the video description. Again, this will take you to the same website. Scroll down here. You can see media creation tool. Click on download now. And once the download is complete, run the exe file. So run this file and then you will see the screen. Click on accept and then by default upgrade this PC now will be selected. Click on next. It will start downloading Windows 10 along with the latest update. Now this process will take some time. Once the download is complete, now before the installation, you will see this screen which says ready to install and by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked. When this is checked, you will not lose any data on the computer. Click on install. After the installation, log into your computer and your windows should be up to date and you should not face any problem updating your windows 10. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.